Hello, friends. I'm going to make some throw pillows for my couch that are Marauder's Map themed. How magical. It'll complete my Harry Potter aesthetic throughout my house. Time for another beverage. This will be my like third. Fun fact, I just had to clean up a huge mess that I made while making my drink. Dumped a giant tub of buttered vegetables all over my floor. I feel like this is becoming way more common. This is one of the most simple projects you can do. If you have ever used a sewing machine before, then you are already set. Cut out two shapes and sandwich some stuff in between them. I'm gonna make more fun stuff with this fabric because I just Love it. Let's just cut out some big squares. And you can make this interesting in a lot of different ways. You can add special trim, little tassels. If you want to make it your house colors, you can add little ribbons to the sides or something, anything. Of course, this would go great with some golden red for some Gryffindor colors, but I'm not a Gryffindor, so I'm just making some Marauders pillows. Fold it over, stitch around all of it except for one little corner. I'm going to hand stitch that so that I can stuff the pillow with this really squishy, magical stuffing. Oh, even though this is plastic, it's very comfy. Satisfying. Just stitch those sides together. Meow, 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 meow. Oh, God. Hello. Let's do this thing. Here we go. Okay. Okay. We got this. We can craft. We've done this before. Oh. Now we're just gonna flip it inside out. If you didn't make the hole too small. You know, I use knitting needles for a lot of sewing projects just to bag stuff out and get all those little corners looking fresh and crisp. What did the pillow say when someone offered it a sandwich? It said, no thanks, I'm stuffed. I'll be here all week. Fancy. Uh, I totally broke my knitting needle. I don't really knit anyway. I opened this really messy bag. There's no easy way to do this. If you're gonna make a mess, at least be drunk when you do so. It's not a great excuse, but hey, it's something. Oh god, I lost the hole. It's all just sitting on the pillow now. You're doing a spectacular job here. Let's just hope that a pet never gets a hold of this and just destroys it. My arm is actually getting tired from stuffing this. This is extraordinarily tedious. Hey Grant, what did you do on Thursday night? Oh, nothing. Just drank alone and stuffed pillows. Hey. You don't want to have ass the stuffing. You want to have it nice and plump and full and happy looking. Otherwise, it's just a really sad pillow that you made by yourself while you were drinking. Yeah, it definitely took me 10 minutes to, to stuff this pillow. <laughs> oh, my life is so charmed. You can close this up in a couple different ways. If you are over it after that 10 minutes of stuffing one goddamn tiny pillow, then get out your stapler and just go to town on it. You got yourself a pillow. Now I probably have, yep, I definitely have white fuzzies all over me from them. That was a mistake. Fine, I'll remove the staple. Magical pillow. Now we're gonna hand stitch a pillow. So what I'm doing is drinking to start, poking it in where I've already stitched on the machine, and I'm doing everything in the channel so it'll be really smooth transition. Tie off that thread. We're doing what's called a slip stitch, which means that you slip it through the channel on one side that you have made just by a piece of folded fabric. So you go on the crease of that fabric, it came out right there, go back in on the other side at the same point. Go back and forth, so just keep on doing that. And you just tie it off and clip that thread. Vacuum this baby to make sure you don't get fuzz all over your face when you lay on it. Which I definitely just did. Let's vacuum. Dun 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 I think I just gave myself a hickey on my chest. That's awkward. There you have it. That's how you make a very simple pillow. I wish that I just had a spell that I could just clean it all up with. Scourgeo! Fuck, it didn't work. I do hope that you enjoyed this episode of Crafting with Cocktails. How to make adorable throw pillows. If you really enjoyed this craft, make sure that you subscribe to my channel and check out all the other videos that I've made because I have made a lot of crazy crafts. I forgot what I, how do I outro? Drinks done, videos done. Wink. Yas. God, I'm so fashion right now.